five golden rings. What's up, guys? It's the, uh, I don't know if it's the 11th day of Christmas. When do you start counting? Is it the first, like, do you start, subtract from the 25th down to the 13th and then 12 days up to it? I don't know. Um, but it, this is day three. This is the, 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 the three French hens day of reviews from the tub. I don't have hens. I have more friggin' Oreos. I got here today the Peppermint Bark Limited Edition. So yet again, potentially a very valuable item that I'm going to be eating. I could be, this is like, this could be like college fund money for Princess Violet and her brothers. But instead, I'm going to eat it for you folks. So as always, you're welcome. Oh, I don't even have it open. It's boom, peppermint. All right. Let me just grab two out of the ba bag thing right off the bat, because let's be honest. It's peppermint, candy candy. Weird. All this flavored shit is weird. Like, I do like these though. I'm an Oreo fiend and I'm a mint and chocolate fiend. And peppermint is in the mint family, hence the name peppermint. Um, that's a good cookie, man. It's weird because it tastes like a candy cane, but that mint aftertaste sticks with you, and I don't really taste the chocolate cookie, but I, but the chocolate, the Oreo, the chocolatey part of the Oreo attaches itself to the aftertaste of the mint, so it's almost like a weird mint Oreo. I don't know if that's bits of real candy cane in there. Right? Isn't peppermint bark those candy cane smashed to shit? All right, I'm going to do a weird series of experiments here to see if I can... All right. Oh, no, 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 there it is. Yeah, that's full on, like... There's peppermint bark in there. Oh, hot damn. Now, here's the test. My wife slash producer enjoys peppermint very much. Hates flavored Oreos. This could go either way. Honey bomb! Would you like a Christmas Oreo? Yeah. Now you are a fan of the peppermint, right? Yeah. But you hate flavored Oreos. I don't hate flavored Oreos. I think they don't need to be flavored because they never do it well. The mystery Oreos were bullshit. They were bullshit. These are good though. Ooh. Mm-hmm. I told you. Were there little pieces of candy cane in it? Yeah, so I did a series of experiments and you can see that on playback. I'm gonna do a I'm gonna do a sandwich bite first and then I wanna separate and do the thing where you lick the icing off. Okay. Should have brought a glass of milk for this, but I got my coffee. No, I like this though. I like these. <laughs> See? Here's why I like them. Because it's a classic Oreo with pepper with like candy canes in it. So you're saying they didn't alter a flavor or invent a flavor. They just they added. added to it for Christmas. Oh. You know what I mean? Right. I, I absolutely know what you mean. Oh, I like these. I want to eat one of them. You can take them all with you. I have to cook dinner, though. Yes, we're going to have dinner soon. So I like, hope. 
Oh, I'm, I like this. Good job, Oreo. You did, and like compared to those bullshit ass Twinkies. Yeah. This is what the Twinkie should. This is what the inside of the Twinkie should have tasted like. Okay, it's more minty than the Twinkie was. Yeah. Hundred percent. Yeah. This is what the Twinkie should have tasted like. Yeah, but this. Twinkie form. Uh, but in their defense, but like no, those Twinkies were ass. But in their defense, they probably had to use a mint extract. With that, they just smashed the shit out of candy canes and mixed it in. Take like used a mint extract. It's the most, like extracts no. in general, other than vanilla, is like the strongest flavors on the planet. Like almond extract for your three color cake. It's a good cake. It's very potent. So like it's like they like spit in it with mint extract. Oh, I'm still pissed off about those. All right, no, relax. It's, it's Christmas. No getting fired up. I can't All right. Help it. So if you had to rate them one to ten, what are we doing? <sighs> Seeing as though the original Oreo cookie is the most per perfect cookie to ever be made. It's facts. I'm going to give this a nine and a half. Because okay, the ten. Whoa. Like nine, nine and a half. Because ten is, is perfect Oreo cookie. If you were a ten, you'd be the. Like, so by adding to it, they deduct it from the score. Also, like you're a bigger mint and chocolate fan than I am. Okay. So like I could see you giving this a ten. I, I don't know what you are or did give it. I but. said to these fine folks that I didn't think the chocolate came through at the at, in the taste, but Oreo at the Oreo flavor attaches to the aftertaste some somehow in the back of your throat. It's an Oreo with peppermint. I think I perfectly described it. In it. Yeah. I don't even know if peppermint bark is the right because I think peppermint bark is bullshit too. Yeah, 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 it's just hard. And, You're chewing on a hard ass candy cane. I got it just. I mean, y'all don't know me that well, but I got suspect teeth and any like bark. I'm out. It's too hard. I'm out. Uh, yeah, so. this is like candy cane Oreo. Candy cane Oreos. But the candy cane, it's small enough you don't even know you're eating candy canes. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. very fine. Like yeah. you'll, you'll see the playback. I did some work. That's um, a good one. I'm gonna eat the shit out of those. Can you bring me a small glass of milk? I got it. Thank really you very much. Like small, like. Like Tony the Tiger glass or like my little baby house glass? No, Tony the Tiger glass, please. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for checking out uh, Peppermint Bark Oreos. I would hold them up and sign off with them. Oh, I got to clean my nails. I'm a dirt bag. For someone who's always in a bathtub, I am a friggin' dirt bag, right? Um, I would hold them up, but they got placed down too far out of reach. And if I reach them, you'll see my schmeckle. Um... Nah, it's over. We're good. Um, so thanks for tuning in, guys. I hope everyone has a, a holly jolly Christmas. It's the best time of the year. And uh, catch y'all tomorrow, man, with some popcorn. Peace.